sure that you are in your shared folder with me so that I can see it, you're going to create a collaborative folder for your project work with your teammates. In order to do this, again, you make sure you're in your shared folder up here. You say New Folder. You call it um, Team Folder. Hit Create. Then what you're going to do is create your sharing. Already it's shared with me. However, you're going to create the sharing privileges with your team. To do this, you click on Share Team Folder, and at this point, you can add the names of people who you want to share it with. Notice that as you type in names, student names will pop up here. So all you need is either their first name and last name or their student ID. You say that they can edit, and once you're done, you hit Done. Then. In order to see who you have shared it with, you can do a couple of things. You can click on the folder and click here. And what you'll see under Advanced button is these are the people you have shared it with so far. And so it's me at school, me and my home number. And that's it. That is how you create your shared folders. And this is where you're going to put items that you are going to work on together. So in addition to just sharing folders, you may also open up a Google Doc and share it individually by clicking on the share button here, adding the email, and determining whether or not the person can edit, comment, or view. So you can do it with documents and with folders.